Okay, everybody. Um, my name is David Quinn. I'm the head of training for the European Neighbourhood Journalism Network, and I'm speaking now live to Dahlia Osman, who is one of our participants from Egypt. Dahlia is uh, a journalist at Al-Mazri al, al um, and as some of you may know, Al-Mazri al, al is one of the uh, most progressive uh, newspapers in Egypt and has been at the forefront of uh, community uh, online um, access for uh, several years. Dahlia, first things first, how are you doing? Uh, I'm fine. And where and about all my you? family is fine, and all my friends is, is fine, are fine. Excellent. Okay, I'm glad. We're very glad to hear that. Um, whereabouts are you, Dahlia? Are you um, in the office or? Yeah, I uh, used to uh, every day go to my uh, office uh, and I uh, do my work. Uh, but uh, we try to return home uh, before uh, eight o'clock. Because of uh, the before curfew. three o'clock. No? Because of the yes. Yeah. What 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 you say? Because of the curfew. Yeah, we are careful, but uh, but we return home before uh, three o'clock. What what is the situation on the ground that you can see at the moment? How are simple things getting on? Things like are you able to get money from uh, from cash machines? Are there are there any shops open? We're hearing reports that it's getting very difficult for people to be able to get uh, access uh, to food. Yeah, it's uh, too difficult to get money from uh, the machine or from uh, the bank. But they said that uh, after uh, 48 hours, we will, uh, we will, we will can uh, get money from the, ca from the cash machine. Uh, also, we, um, uh, for the shops, uh, the, some shops open between uh, the hours uh, from uh, uh, 8 uh, at morning to 3 o'clock. Uh, and until now, we, we can buy uh, uh, our uh, things, uh, but there is a problem from uh, uh, off the bread uh, because uh, people uh, can, can sometimes uh, buy uh, bread and sometimes they can because they uh, they uh, they uh, the shops of the bread they uh, some uh, after three o'clock it was closed. Dahlia, are you finding that uh, it's uh, very difficult to get a, a, a feeling as to what the vast majority of people in Egypt are looking for, or do you think that uh, the, the popular uh, movement that's on the street right now has huge support across the country because we, we only get to see what we can see on the screens and on CNN and on the BBC. Um, how, how widespread is the support, do you think, for, uh, for what's happening in, in Cairo and Alexandria? Uh, no, now, David, uh, you know, I am uh, just returned from El uh, Tahrir Square mm -hmm. uh, and I uh, saw there uh, a lot of people but I can't set the number because they, uh, there are a big uh, number of people there. Uh, but now there is uh, two, um, two, uh, two, uh, two kinds of people. Uh, one of them uh, don't agree of Mr. Mubarak and they didn't want Mr. Mubarak. Uh, and some of them uh, said that we want Mubarak because we are now have a lot of difficult in get money and uh, some uh, shops are destroyed uh, so we uh, we don't need any change we don't uh, need any destroy in our country uh, and uh, the others uh, said that, uh, and uh, the others was a lot of people in uh, the in the in Tahrir square said that uh, we wanted to uh, Mr Mubarak to leave the country uh, a lot of voices in uh, in Tahrir Square said that, and in the opposite uh, side, uh, a lot of people said, "No, we don't uh, need the Mr. Mubarak to leave." So uh, there is a growing number of people then who are suggesting that stability is what matters most, and and ultimately that perhaps the strategy that uh, 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 Mubarak is, is uh, pursuing, the strategy of withdrawing the police. 
and uh, and allowing for a certain degree of uh, of, of chaos upon the streets is is causing some people to to get very worried and, and, and actually look towards uh, the Mubarak regime to provide some stability then? Yes, yes. Uh, some of uh, them uh, said uh, that uh, the regime of Mubarak, uh, they need the regime of Mubarak for the stability of the country, of our country. Tell me about um, Omar Suleiman. And he yesterday made uh, a statement saying that he had been authorized to uh, pursue uh, reform and engage with reform uh, actors within, within the country. How is that being seen? Is uh, Suleiman being perceived as being genuine in that, or do you think that large numbers of people want the whole of the regime to go, including uh, Omar Suleiman? No, not all... Uh... All the people here in Egypt uh, want uh, Mr. Ramatiman to go. Uh, as you uh, as you see uh, in the screen and the BBC and CNN and uh, other uh, and the La Arabia television, uh, that uh, the people who are uh, in Al Tahrir Square uh, says that they must uh, they didn't want anything from Mr. Mubarak related with the regime of Mr. Mubarak. Uh, like um, the new government, uh, which he met, uh, like uh, uh, like uh, Omar Suleiman, uh, but uh, most of people uh, in the street in uh, in Egypt uh, said that uh, Mr. Omar Suleiman is good, uh, is a good man, and uh, we want him. So there are a substantial body of people that you've talked to in Tahrir Square and elsewhere. That, that view Suleiman as being genuine and, and, and they lend their support somewhat to him then? Some support to Omar Suleiman. Uh, the, the people here in Egypt, uh, in street, uh, the, the people in the street here in Egypt uh, says that Omar, uh, support Omar Suleiman. Uh, and, uh, but the people in the square, in the Tahrir, said we, de we don't need anything related with the regime of Mr. Mubarak. So it's a, it's but a, the people, uh, but the people, uh, the, the men or the women who was in street, uh, not uh, in, uh, not in the Tahrir Square, uh, like Mr. Omar Suleiman. So it's a, it's a it's still a, a divided picture to some degree um, out in the street, Dalia. Um, what I was going to ask is: there's a lot of uh, consideration here um, in in Britain and in the US and across um, Western Europe about the role of the Muslim Brotherhood um, and whether or not the Muslim Brotherhood will come to the fore in these protests and, and whether or not the Muslim Brotherhood will, in effect, um, pick up the pieces uh, in, in the coming weeks and months. The concern, obviously, is, is that the, the Muslim Brotherhood uh, poses to some a, uh, a, a picture of, of religious um, fundamentalism. What, what's the attitude on, on the street towards the Muslim Brotherhood of the people that, that you've been talking to? The Muslim Brotherhood here, uh, they didn't play any role uh, to, uh, to appreciate uh, the people to uh, go to the Tahrir Square. They not related with this, uh, this what, of what happened. The, the people who are in Al Tahrir Square not uh, related uh, with the Muslim Brotherhood. They are people, uh, they are uh, young people, not related uh, when, with any parties, not related with the Muslim Brotherhood. Uh, this, this situation now, not related with Muslim Brotherhood. Finally. What happened? Not what happened. Not related with any party. Not related uh, with any uh, Muslim Brotherhood. Not related with anyone. The the, the all the all people who are in the Tahrir Square, the uh, are the people from uh, or a part of from our country. Not uh, not related with any party. Not related with Muslim Brotherhood. So an organic movement that represents a broad spectrum um, of Egyptian society then. Um, finally, yeah. 
Dahlia, I um, was just going to ask you, do you, um, how, how long do you think these protests can go on for? Um, given that we, d we haven't really seen much movement uh, from uh, the Mubarak regime, apart from uh, Omar Suleiman's statement yesterday, um, how, how long can people keep doing this? I mean, we, we see the number of people getting bigger and bigger, and today uh, uh, the proposed Million Man yeah. March in uh, Alex. And, we, um, we, can't, we, can't ex we can't expect uh, the time. We can't expect that. Uh, because now the, uh, the requests of uh, people uh, are now different. They ask it to, uh, to, to give Mubarak uh, and, uh, to a court and ask him about uh, what he made from the country. Uh, the, uh, some of them said uh, we didn't want uh, Mubarak and he, he, we wanted him to leave. Uh, there, the, there are now a lot of requests. Okay, well, so I'll... we can, so we can, we can't expect uh, about the time. We can expect it. Well. We uh, wait and uh, see how things progress, and uh, we're very glad that we're able to get through to you, Dahlia. Our uh, thoughts go out to you and hope that you uh, stay safe and, uh, and, and manage to get uh, all the information that you need to get um, in, during the course of your work. Um, best to everybody at Al Masri Al Yum, and uh, we'll be in touch very soon. Yeah, okay. Thank you, David. Thank you, and bye. Take care now. Yeah, I will. Thank you. Bye bye.